Oui, oui. That is the alti belly button, you see. Mwah. Things really start popping around this time in your pregnancy. But the good news is, you're already two-thirds of the way there. Celebrate with some fancy French soda. That's not a euphemism for wine. And when you toast, take a look at that bottle, because it's the same size as Le Bebe at week 26. 14 inches and just over a pound and a half. Also, his eyes are starting to open and are probably rolling at my bad French accent. Sacre bleu. Oh, mon dieu. I should have paid attention more in French class. Just like your starting salary, your maternity leave is often up for negotiation. Here's how to arm yourself to get the best deal for you and your baby. Do your research. Look into what maternity leave your state requires and what the individual company policy is. Talk to other women at your company and other companies to see what's the norm. Formulate a plan, negotiate. Trade in sick days or vacation days, but also show that you have the company's needs in mind by presenting a strategy on how you'll accomplish all of your work goals. And start locally, meaning talk to your direct supervisor first before going to human resources. Your boss knows how valuable you are and can help fight to make sure you get what you need in order to stay at your company, to keep you there. Why does making it to 40 weeks make a difference? Babies born at 39 weeks and later have fewer problems and they do better on tests of intelligence and gross motor skills. Here are some key tips for reaching the magic date. Eat real food, not the processed kind, and eat often to keep the flow of nutrients steady. Stock up on supplies that say fragrance-free, no synthetic fragrance or phthalate-free. Be good to your gums and see your dentist regularly. Go when you gotta go to avoid developing a UTI. Steer clear of all smoke. Fight off infections by washing your hands regularly and avoiding sick people. And make sure you're getting the right dose of vitamin D and that you're not skimping on DHA. And if all that fails, just cross your legs and hope for the best. Hold that baby in. You can't really do that, but you could try. People love to give pregnant women advice, even when they don't ask for it. Here's your daily dose of unsolicited advice. If you do decide to eat the placenta, uh, I don't know, add some salt? Oh, I really don't know. You're, you're on your own with this. I mean, that's, that's cool. I typically don't eat anything from my body. Wonder if it's tough. Uh, steak sauce? I don't know. What do I do here? There's a lot of stuff you're expected to give up when you're expecting. Join me now in a moment of silence as this pregnancy pause is dedicated to Red Bull. Shout out to Red Bull. Now you have to stay awake in work meetings through sheer willpower. Ooh, it's no bull. You're gonna have to do it. If you want to see what's coming up in your pregnancy next week, then like, subscribe, and share. I'll be here every week.